Hey there guys and welcome back to another video. I'm of course the captain and in today's video if you haven't guessed by um, all this alcohol on the table I'm gonna get drunk <laughs> as today guys I'm going to be tasting Japanese alcohol so we've got a few beers, we've got lager, we have a couple of wine and sake of course is what you probably know most from Japan so I've got one, two, three, four, five bottles so yeah this is gonna get messy so guys, here is Anthony joining me for another video and of course we're doing another Japanese one as last time we did Japanese snacks this time we're doing alcohol a lot and a lot of alcohol so we're probably not going to be able to talk by the end of this video <laughs> You bought all this alcohol so I look like a twat on camera I did indeed, that was my <laughs> other plan so we're going to start off with some wine because Japanese do wine and they do it slightly different as usually there is a plum in the bottles of wine so neither of us are big fans of wine yeah no. so I bought little ones in this here box so there's three different flavors we're not going to be drinking everything on this table we'll be taking a couple of mouthfuls of each as otherwise we would probably die so anyway let's open this wine and see what it tastes like Oh damn, looks like it's got a testicle in it. It is, it has got a testicle in it. Oh, right. it's wrinkly. I told you, they have plums in them. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm choosing this one, so you can choose one of these two. I'm going to go for this one. Extra Seho, or however you pronounce that name, I'm yeah. not sure. The testicle looks smaller in this one. <laughs> <laughs> so these are 17% alcohol, and they've got a floating turd in them. <laughs> or a testicle or a small brain I'm not entirely sure which but it doesn't look nice guys I'm gonna go testicle well guys let's open one of these up and we'll give it a quick try I'm doing yours first what? I'm doing it first you drink it it looks horrible uh, do I have to drink it out of the thing? out of the pot jar? with the testicle in <laughs> I can't tip it out of the testicle. I don't want to drink the testicle. <laughs> drink the testicle. Drink the testicle. Here goes nothing. Oh, wow. That smells wicked. <coughs> Jesus Christ. It's like fucking brimstone and hellfire. Wow. <laughs> You heard it here first, guys. Brimstone and Hellfire is what this one tastes like. Oh, Jesus. Try that. Tastes like wine. Not a big fan of wine, like I say, guys. That's, that is gross. Yeah. <laughs> one down and like 30 something to go. Is that a burn in your throat? A little bit, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that was a bad one to start with. I told you, get these out of the way first. Neither of us like wine, so let's drink the wine and move on to some nicer things. Just start with a beer. It's bad, isn't it? It's okay. <laughs> it's not as bad as the first one, though. It's not good, it's not good, but it is better than the first one. It burns the same as the first one, <laughs> but the taste's better. So guys, the third wine we have is extra honey. So I'm hoping this one tastes a little bit nicer with this weird fruit in it. Yume fruit, that's what it is, it's a yume. <laughs> it's gross, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Ah. Oh God. It's bad. Oh, that's even worse than the first one. We thought that one was going to be nicer, <laughs> but it is not. It says royal honey, Jesus. but it tastes nothing like honey. So guys, we just tried the free wines with the weird yum fruit in it. Yeah. I didn't like any of them. <laughs> So I'm unfortunately going to give them a, a combined rating of two. I'm, uh, no. No? No, zero. Zero. <laughs> As I said guys, we are not fans of wine and 
yeah, we didn't like yeah, it. Yeah, no, not for If you're a fan of wine, then yeah, you might like it, but we didn't. <laughs> Definitely not. Well, that's three bottles of wine down. Let's try the uh, fourth bottle of wine. Oh, God's sake, what was it? It's something in Japanese. Kure Umishu, plum wine with collagen. Yeah, what he said, because I am going to try pronounce it. Oh, that's actually not a bad. I don't know whether to believe them or not. No, that's quite nice. That's, that, that doesn't taste like wine. That's nice. I, I don't was, believe him. I was pleasantly surprised. Yeah, it <laughs> it's not half bad, is it? It's not bad. Those were disgusting. Never buy them again. But this one, this wine actually tastes quite nice. I don't know what's in it or what it's called, but yeah. Again, guys, all these products are from the Japan Center. They have a wide range of food, alcohol, everything you can think of, and there's a link in the description. So go check it out, guys. Uh, now we're gonna give the Kurei Umeshu which is uh, plum wine with collagen. I'm going to give that a rating. That was, that was quite nice. I'm going to go. I'm going to go six out of ten on that for me. Yeah, I'd give it either five. We're not fans of wine. Yeah. <laughs> if you haven't guessed already, guys. But it wasn't bad. I'd drink yeah, it right. if there was no else around. But yeah, five out of ten. Full beer. Down it. Down it. Down it. I don't think you can drink a full beer. <laughs> So guys, up next we're going to have a beer. So, we're going to choose this one. Which is this. <laughs> Come on, Dave, good luck. <laughs> sure, give me the hard one to pronounce. It has no English on it whatsoever. It's got yuzu juice in it. It's got what, what? Yuzu, yuzu juice. You yuzu, you yuzu juice? Yeah, yuzu, yuzu, yuzu lulu juice. <laughs> it's got yuzu lulu juice in it. Apparently. What was that? I don't know, you said it. Four and a half percent though, not bad for a beer. 4.5% alcohol, and it's called something in Japanese. Uh, yuzu craft beer. So, it has a yuzu fruit on the front. I presume it's a fruit. I'm gonna have a crack at this. The Karuzawa beer. That's what I think. Sounds right to me. Yeah. Tastes like beer. It's got a fruity, lemony taste to it. It's quite nice. It's not bad. No. So guys, the Yuzu Craft beer was surprisingly nice. And uh, I'm going to give it like a 7 out of 10. Yeah, I'll give it, I can agree with that. It's no Budweiser. But it's got a fruity taste, I kind of like it. Another, another ale, a white ale. Bye. I hope I'm going to try. All <laughs> oh, that suspense, and you don't think we're going to try. Bye, bye, okay. Go for, it. Go, go for it. go. The Kiwichi Brewery. I probably butchered that, and I apologise. But, yeah. <laughs> this is why I invite him on here. Oh, what are you doing? What are you doing? <laughs> I guess then I said it wrong. <laughs> the Japanese gods will smite you. Yeah. It's very fizzy. <laughs> what a mess you've made on the table. <laughs> on, I only had three sips of wine and, a, and now half a beer. Beer. Beer? Just beer, yeah. Just beer. So guys, white ale. Let's give it a go. 5.5% alcohol, tastes like beer. Just your average beer. Fosters, your yeah. average Fosters. Fosters, Budweiser, same well, kind of thing. Yeah. Clean, my servant. Got my foot. So I'll have to clean up the mess for me. <laughs> At least you want me making a mess. Yeah, well, I bet you shook my can up. So guys, that was white ale with a nice cool picture of an owl on it. Yeah. I'd probably give it 
five. Yeah. About average beer. Yeah. So guys, up next we are having a spritzer. I'm not entirely sure what a spritzer is. I'm not an alcoholic. I wasn't until this video. But a spritzer, no idea what it is. This has a picture of a kiwi on it. Oh, I have one of these. So this is actually done by Asahi, which I've actually drank Asahi before. We have a bottle somewhere here, this one here. And it's from the same company, and this is a spritzer. Mine's kiwi flavor. I kind of like kiwis, so I'm kind of excited to everyone, see what this is. Everyone likes grapes. Cheers. Cheers. Oh yeah. That's good. Yeah, that is really good. <laughs> I have no idea what a spritzer is, so you might call me stupid, but this tastes amazing, guys. It doesn't taste like alcohol whatsoever, which is yeah. probably kind of dangerous. That tastes fantastic. It tastes great. I love kiwis. For 4% 4 alcohol content. Now I'd probably give the kiwi an 8 out of 10. Yeah. It just agree. tastes amazing, guys. I'll agree with that. Swapsies? Yeah. Oh god, yeah, that is good, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. I prefer the kiwi one to this one. No, I prefer that one. Well, guys, as I say, these are from the Japan Centre. These taste great, I'm not going to lie. That one I love the most. So, guys, if you fancy checking them out, I'll put a link in the description below. Yeah, but for now, recommended. we're going to move on to the next beer. Now, I've actually had this beer before because I visited the actual Japan Centre shop down in London and I was there with my brother of course, he's been in many of my videos that I've been down in London in and I do like Sapporo so, let's see what you think about Sapporo Japan's oldest brand since 1876 Yeah <laughs> Don't you guys just love that sound of when the, you clip it? Ah, the air squeezes out. It's amazing. I love it. Nice. Exactly how I remember tasting it. Amazing. I swear I'm not an alcoholic. Line. Anyway, guys, Sapporo, I would give probably a seven out of ten. No, six, six out of ten. It says premium. <laughs> six and a half. <laughs> six and a half out of ten. There we go, guys. We got into it. We're going to be wasted by the end of this video. It's calling me old. That's not very nice. You are old. I'm not old. You are. I'm like three years older than you. Exactly. And I'm old. <laughs> that doesn't make me old. I don't feel old. You look old. God dang it. <laughs> anyway, guys, let's continue in this video yes. because because we got loads more to drink. <laughs> We've yes. already had four different types of wine. We've had four beers. Well, three beers and a spritzer. Which is Whatever very nice. That is. It was very nice. So guys, I hope yeah. you've enjoyed this video. It's been alcoholic in our endeavours to enlightenment in the Japanese ways. Of getting pissed. <laughs> exactly. So guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. We've drank too much, I'd say. But we've had a lot of fun. 